Hi all, it's Jack from Preact here and today we're going to be taking a look at some changes with business units in Dynamics 365. Microsoft have made some changes that allow us to customise what happens when users are moved between business units. Previously, when a business unit of a user was changed, the security role from the previous business unit were removed and a new security role would need to be given. Microsoft now allow us to change the behaviour allowing security roles to follow the user, as well as their records. This means that users can now access records from more than one business unit at a time. Let's take a look and see how this works. As you can see, it's currently showing that roles will be removed and that records will not be moved to the new business unit. If we make the appropriate changes in the back end and take a look once we've made these modifications, we can see that this will show roles will not be removed and the records will be moved to the new business unit. This allows users to see records from not only their old business unit, but also their new business unit. This is really useful for users that need to see data in other business units than their own. For instructions on how to change these settings, please see the link in the description. Please get in touch with us if you have any questions regarding business units. Like this video if you've enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe to the Preact YouTube channel if you want to see more videos about Dynamics 365 and the Power Platform in the future.